Buying me into motorbikes here. Got the BSA Bantam Club here. From Birmingham, of course, originally. Of course, some of the British bikes have made a comeback here. No, I don't know so much about bikes, so anybody who wants to dial further into the detailing, they don't always have ride hubs, but certainly some people will know the makes, models, and specifications of these bikes. Not being a bike, bike buff, I'm not always into the technical details, but this is 9050 BSA Bantam D1, all matching numbers in need of TLC there. Needs a bit of restoration there. Another one here, 1956 D3 198 CC. BSA bikes here, there we are. Can even win one here. We have Triumphs here, there we are, make this made a comeback. I believe Triumph cars potentially could make a comeback as well, although unfortunately the name was owned by the Germans so they will be saying what happens and where they may probably. It would be nice if they may come back to Britain, certainly they were made in Coventry. But this is Triumph bikes here, the side car here. Fancy one of those. And of course Royal Enfield are making bikes in India. Some of the cars here. Now, a lot of these did not go into the Grand Parade of cars. Some are leaving here. Got the Leyden Sharp on there, the motorhome there. The motorhome there. The Jag here. The 5.3. Triumph Herald here. Some of the imports as well. Airfield here at South Surrey. And we have a lovely old Wolseley. Grandfather Wal my grandfather had a Wolseley in the day. Wolseley 6 110 Mark II automatic here. Lovely car, lovely condition, lovely classic to own. Certainly feel how to drive it, there we are, that lovely old Wolverley. And we have, next door, an invalid carriage. You don't see many of these anymore. The old invalid carriage, here it's coming out here. Some people leaving early, no doubt. Child the car, but the old. Now, invalid carriage, Invercar, I think it was. Made these, you can see it was uh, easy to get in and out of. <laughs> There's quite a few of these around, until around about the 1990s. But of course, I suppose the mobility scheme changed all that. Mini, MGB Roadster, and we have that lovely old Triumph 2000. There we are, very popular there, aren't we? Amongst the families as well. And we have another. Got a Ford Capri here, yeah, some of these went in the main room, some didn't. The Triumph Stag there. There was a bus going around here, but I think the bus might finish now. The old barracks over there. Well, some people leaving here. Right by the barracks here. Towards the edge of the airfield here. Some of the cars here, over there. I have so many barracks. Now, I was going to wait for on the bus, but two went straight past. The stops over there by the toilets, and uh, they disappear. Some of the vehicles coming out here. There's cars. Here, Morris Minor, and that Range Rover demonstration vehicle there, and the true full size 
Range Rover behind here. The early Range Rover Mark 1 here. And we're in the grounds of the South Valley Barracks. On the airfield here, you see the amount of people that visit there with the coaches here. Meanwhile, some more cars coming out here. Theme of vintage extravaganza here, the country extravaganza certainly. It's been a bit wet this year, certainly yesterday very wet. Uh, and today it's been a few showers as well, but certainly it's all taking place. Including serving local charities no doubt as well. We're on the Range Rover there, I think he's on patrol here. At South Sunny. And we have another Land Rover here. He's taking a tractor out. Some people leaving now. It's gone four o'clock. Then we got the uh, 35 here in grey. <laughs> Lovely old, I think it's a Morris. It's either often or a Morris there. And we have now another old Austin. Lovely old Austin here. Oh, or is it the Morris Cowley? Oh. It might be the Morris Cowley, certainly. Cowley on there. That gentleman there, one of them, he's got the Morris Miner there, Morris Traveller. Here we have, thanks to the Austin Cambridge coming out here. Something my grandpa had, there we are. The Austin Cambridge Morris Hutcher variant. I think it's a bit of white. That's the Cambridge. And of course, the major diesel. 